It's almost been a year since the work started on renovating mm. Lake Shelby Park and Gulf Shores. Yeah, the job was supposed to be done by May, but delays have put it months behind. Fox 2 News Baldwin County reporter Hal Sherrick with a look at what's done and what's left to do. Gulf State Park sees more than a million visitors a year, and Lake Shelby sits at its heart. Investing in the amenities of the public access area has been needed for some time, so the state allocated the funds from its share of offshore oil and gas lease revenue to do just that. On a cost per acre point of view, or just the, the impracticality of doing it as nice as this, without that federal money, uh, the Mesa money, it wouldn't have been practical. And what we've got here is something unique and special. Four and a half million dollars to reshape the park from the entrance to the restrooms. Material and labor shortages have put the completion months behind, but it's beginning to take shape, and most areas are now open to the public. It's nice, they've got it set up. I mean, we couldn't ask for more, I don't think. Oh, there's just so much to do, so many different options, and they literally they beg to come out here just to come to the playground. The new age designated playgrounds are just some of the improvements. Two brand new dog parks are open and just waiting on signs to designate which is for big or small dogs. Two new boat ramps are on hold until the Corps of Engineers approves the plans. The next big milestone will be when the new restrooms open, which should be next week. While disappointed in the time it's taking, Gulf State Park Director Gary Ellis says feedback has been encouraging. The social media aspect of it has been very positive. The uh, conversation with staff and our um, executive team have been great so we're we're um it's not going to disappoint once we kind of put the finishing touches on it it's going to be um, really an outstanding feature the theme of the new park is we all need to play more with all of the new opportunities here that shouldn't be hard to do the other big question about gulf state park is what's going on with the pier well park officials tell me Due to a lot of setbacks there, they don't expect it to be reopened and rebuilt until probably the end of next year at the earliest. Reporting live in Gulf Shores, Hal Sherrick, Fox 10 News.